my child, I know you hurt and you can't let go. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Ina Pandora here, and I'm back with a new video. Today we're going to be doing this colorful um, makeup look. I finally got a hold of the BH Cosmetics Take Me to Brazil palette, so I decided to use it today. As lately, I've been inspired to do one palette makeup look so if you want to see how I did it then keep on watching and before you leave don't forget to subscribe and join the family let's learn together explore together and test products together without much rumbling let's get into it before I do anything I'm gonna start with lip injection from Too Faced it's a glossy one to pal my lip a little bit to prime my face today I'm going to be using Smashbox for the finish minimize pores I'm going to apply it all over where my pores are more prominent. For my foundation today, I'm going to be using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place Makeup Foundation in shade 1 and 2. For the brows today, I'm going to be using a NYX Eyebrow Gel in the shade Espresso. And I'm going to be applying it with my Sigma A65. To prime my eyes, I'm going to be using eye primer from Sigma in the shade Persuade. And for the eyeshadows today, I'm going to be using BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil. To tell you the truth, I was very skeptical about this palette. The first time when I did the swatches on my hand, they did not look very promises, but as you can tell, it did surprise me. So. Without much rambling, I'll start. When I got the palette, I also got this set from BH Cosmetics. I'm not in love with this set, but I will use it in today's tutorial. And I'm going to start with this color right here. And I'm going to be using my Sigma E25 brush, hands down. This is the best brush in the market, and I'm not gonna trade it for any other. Unless you have a very tacky base, to be honest, I don't think they're gonna be as pigmented. So make sure you don't set your eyeshadow base before if you want that color to pop. And I'm literally swirling in the eyeshadow base to get them on the brush. So they're not exactly the most pigmented eyeshadows, but you still can make it work. And I'm gonna bring it all the way in. Don't worry if it's not perfect, because we're going to cut the crease later. Then with the BH Cosmetics, I don't, it doesn't have a number. So with this one, I'm gonna go in into this color and add a little pop of color and blend in the inner corner, like right here. Actually, I'm going to, all right. I feel like it took off too much color, so I'm gonna pack back in. Then with my Sigma E30, I'm going to go into the black eyeshadow. All right, then with whatever it's left on the brush, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go around the eye to intensify the crease line. To cut the crease today, I'm going to be using a Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. Start with the white shade and the BH Cosmetics uh, brush that came in a set. Also, I'm going to highlight my brow, bo brow bone with this one. Then I'm going to go in with this bright yellow in my L05 Sigma brush. Then with the slime color right here and E45 a Sigma brush, I'm going to continue packing on. Then with my Sigma E60, I'm going to go in into this beautiful green color. Then I'm going to go back in with this green, this darker green color, and I'm going to try to blend everything in the outer corner. Then I'm going to go in a little bit with the black at the outer corner and try to intensify the outer corner. Now we're going to apply eyeliner. Mascara today is going to be Maybelline Lash Sensational. 
for the lashes today I'm going to be using lashes for days pro lash five pack from pro beauty essential to conceal under eye today I'm going to be using same Too Faced Born This Way, a multi-use sculpted concealer. I'm going to set the concealer with a Laura Mercier translucent powder. For the under eye I'm going to go into this lime color with my Sigma L45. Then with my Sigma E15 I'm going to go in with that dark green and intensify the outer corner. Then on the outer corner, I'm going to go with the black and intensify it a little bit more, just over here. In the waterline, I don't know how safe this is, so if you're going to try it, you're going to do it on your own at your own risk. However, if you have a white gel eyeliner, that will work as well as what I'm going to do right now. So I'm going to apply the concealer on the waterline. And I'm gonna tap it with this yellow. Then I'm gonna add mascara, more of the, the same white color to kind of clean the inner corner. To contour my face today, I'm going to be using my all time favorite Sigma Sculpt Highlight and, and Contour Palette. And with my Sigma F23 brush, I'm gonna go into the throw shape. To blush today, I'm going to be using Sigma Blush Cheek Palette. And with my Sigma F37, I'm going to go in into Tiger Lily. To highlight today, I'm going to use my Sugar Glow Kit from Anastasia. And I'm gonna go in with Marshmallow and F35 Sigma Brush. For the lipsticks today, I'm gonna use a Sigma liquid lipsticks in the shade New Mod and Anti Venom. And this is it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you did, give us a big like and join the family and subscribe to my channel to, uh, for more videos like this. And uh, this is it. I love you all, and I'll see you on my next one. Bye.